Hello and welcome, my net navi leaves. Oh, you can peek behind the curtain. That doesn't matter. We are back with Mega Man Battle Network 3. Which hopefully, today, isn't as scream inducing. But just for good measure, you know what, and because I like the clip, I'll send you this while I go grab it. This also sums up Friday very well. <laughs> but hey, next Friday we're gonna go into Final Fantasy V, so yeah, I'm looking forward to that. It's my second favorite Final Fantasy. But we're here for Mega Man today, and we need to go to Daddy. To do something. I forgot what we... Have to do. It's in a meeting. Okay. Give him the data disk. It's in a meeting with the officials. Oh, we can give it to this guy. Okay, which... You know what? No! After what we experienced two times now, I would not give an important thing to anybody else. He could be a traitor. He could be part of the World 3. Like... Yeah... It wouldn't surprise me. I'm sure he gets this. We give over the data disk. Wanna go home now? Okay. Oh, wait. There he is. Uh, yeah. What I wanted to say is... I'm not really complaining about this. It's kind of okay. I don't mind it. But, logically, in this futuristic world... A data disk? Not sending it via email? Yeah, that's... Suspension of disbelief, I guess. It falls under that. You brought me my data disk. Thanks. Yeah, I gave it to the researcher upstairs. Hey, what's Chad doing here? Silab just held a joint meeting with the officials to discuss how to handle the annual influx of evil viruses. The annual influx of evil viruses. Yeah, that seems like a problem, but how about uh, trying to do something about... I think this is in the span of two years. Three evil organizations rising in that quite short span of time. Yes, two of these three are technically the same, but uh, the world three is re-rising again. So, you know... Maybe the problem comes from that. Maybe don't cut off the branches if you want to get rid of the tree. Go to the roots. We just happened to run into each other there. Oh yeah, I'm going to be in the N1 Grand Prix tomorrow. Wow, the same Grand Prix that everyone in town's talking about. No, n not that one, the other one. That's great. Oh, but unfortunately I have a meeting tomorrow. It doesn't look like I can go root for you. Sorry. <laughs> Don't worry about that, Dad. I am used to negligence by now. You t taught me that from an early age. Yeah, I know. I mean, if I had told you earlier, you'd just work yourself sick trying to make time to go, right? I'm sorry to make you worry about me so much, Lan. Here, I'll give you this to make up for me not being able to go. The N1 Grand Prix will be packed with fierce battles, right? It won't do if your pet broke again. We got the pet cat. Why doesn't everybody have one of those? Like, right now? Are there actually people who do not put a screen on their phone? Like, like a safety screen thingy? I always forget how dumb people actually are. If you put your pet... If you put your pet in that, an elephant couldn't break it. Say, are you going to be in the N1 Grand Prix too, Chord? Yes. Is one of your parents coming to cheer you on? No, they won't be coming. Oh, well, anyway, I wish you both the best of luck. Hmm. <sighs> Now then, I'd better get back to work. Chart, 
Won't be losing tomorrow. <laughs> I told you before, and I tell you again. You don't stand a chance. I'm going to win. If I were you, I'd just concentrate on trying to pass the first round. What's his problem? Why's he always gotta be like that? He makes me so mad. Calm down, Lan. Chart is probably just on edge because of tomorrow. Let's head home and sleep early for the Grand Prix. Yeah, yeah, I know. I promise, though, I'm not losing to him. I kinda actually hate that storyline between Chort and Lan. Not their rivalry. The thing is, while they were still rivals, they warmed up to each other in the second game. Like, Chort acknowledged that Lan is a capable net battler in that one. And now it's kind of back to, like, how it was before. He's just an a-hole. He basically has no personality in this game besides, I don't like you, Lan, you idiot. And that's kind of dumb. They don't have to be friends. That's a different thing, but, you know. The morning of the Enron Grand Prix Championship. Probably something will happen so we cannot partake, but have to go into a dungeon that is somehow connected to the World 3. Lan, wake up. It's morning. Uh, five more minutes. Today's the N1 Grand Prix! Gasp. Phew, I almost overslept. You can at least try waking yourself up on a day like today. No, fuck you, Mega Man. You are, well, yes, you are his clock. You are his alarm. He cannot try to wake up himself. It's like setting an alarm on your phone that wakes you up. Just that you are, uh, well, more or less sentient. Well, I guess in case of Mega Man, you are very sentient being, but still... That's part of your function as a PET. So you should wake him up. Right? It's not that. I was so excited I had trouble falling asleep. Yeah, well, anyway, let's go win that tournament. Yeah. That's why we're in this in the first place. <sighs> Alright, come on. Let's head over to the TV station where the Grand Prix will be held. That TV station was on Beach Street, right? Look out, world! Here we come! Lan, you got mail. I told you, he has not yet. Hey, today is finally the N1 Grand Prix. I'm in block A, so my battle is pretty early. I'll go on ahead to, of you to the TV station. Go on ahead of you to the TV station. Nobody says it like that. People would just say, I'll go on ahead, meet you uh, on, on ahead to the TV station. Like, it's not wrong, but nobody talks like that. See you at the finals. Okay. Um. Um. I want to have a look at that case, actually. What does this thing look like? Okay. So it's a case like that. How do we get to Beach Street? Probably through the train. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, the kid from ACDC will be in the N1. I'm going to with my family to watch the N1. Good luck, Lan. I hope that so if someone from Electopia wins. It would be a shame to lose to another country. Today should be a lot of fun. The N1 tour will soon depart. Please get ready, everyone. So, can I get in here? Beach. We can finally buy the beach pass. Welcome to Beach Street. N1 is being held at the very end of this street. Whoops. Oh, well, we need it later anyway. My husband is late! He better hurry or we'll miss the N1! A poster from a big candy manufacturer. I thought this was fast food. They're famous for lots of other things besides candy, too. This looks like some burgers and fries, doesn't it? Is that just me? 
This kiosk sells a lot of TV character items. They even have seem to have Ribita cards. Yay, well. The rack is jammed full of posters. The popular ones always sell out quickly. You can jack into the posters. No, you can't, but that would be funny. And so is it just me or isn't there a lot of stuff to jack into? Like like the small area thingies. I have a feeling there were much more in the previous two. But oh well. Dude! I have some for real cool from Ethiopia. Wanna buy it? Use it to modify the Navicus program. But the cool, huh? You can't usually get them in Electopia. I'll sell it to you for 5,600 zenes. Buy it. We don't have enough. I kind of hate this as well. Technically, it's cool, but... Aren't we the first one to have that custom thing? Which is not open to the public, so... How do other people get the programs for that? That doesn't make sense. Even this old timer wants to see the net battle. He, he, he. You'll swallow my dentures there. Okay. That's fine. A building that houses schools and other offices. Offices. If I go early, I'll have no longer to wait. So I decided to window shop instead. Rows and rows of designer goods at ridiculous prices. Go down the hill and walk away to get to the N1. The map of Beach Street. The red mark must be where I am. That's usually how that works. The TV station is on your right. The coast on your left. The hospital is over there. But the road is shut today because all of all the N1 spectators. Oh yeah, shut the road to the hospital! Yeah, especially at a tournament where, like, thousands of people gather in a very tight grape formation. Nothing can go wrong there that the hospital would be needed, right? Yeah, I know, it's just those street cone thingies. An ambulance could drive over them. But, even if you drive over them, they could still get stuck in a very unfortunate position in the car. And then that's it. Oh, you have time to move them away? No, you might have not. Especially if you don't position anyone near them. That's just a guy. It's not his job to do that. Moneymaker, hello and welcome. Okay, we gotta sing. Oh, finally something that makes sense. Wait a minute. Uh, yeah, I'll give a shout out while I listen to the song. Uh, da -da -da. I don't have desktop audio on this. What? Yeah, I just said we don't have desktop on this yeah. anyway. And I said it while you said that. Yeah. So the fat rat the same thing again. and Cecilia Gold escaping gravity. Oh, wait. Fudge! You see? And that's what's gonna, you gotta get instead of other stuff. That seems like it startled you a bit there. Okay, let's get out YouTube. This is gonna be good. Well, we'll see. Gotta listen to it first and then I'll sing. I think it's this one. This seems correct. It has lyrics, that's good.
this song part of something? Well, this is free to use on YouTube, Twitch, and other so. Oh! Oh, we wouldn't even have to mute. That's cool. That's free to use. Okay, okay, I think I have it. I listened to it. Uh, you know what? I think I'm gonna stand up for a bit. It's easier to sing while standing up. That is now fixed. Let's see. Reposition myself a bit so that I can see the screen better. Nothing happened. That's good. Okay, okay. So I'm gonna start. Uh, am I audible enough like this? A bit more quiet than you want. Bit more quiet. Mm -hmm. Okay, then I have How to. It's more of a quiet song. Okay, I guess this works then though. Okay, so let's go. Land, nobody's innocent, hand to mouth, we live like demons, stuck in the phantom zone, lost in the thunderdome, <laughs> drool the day, we found the impossible, now we're unstoppable, taking off the world beneath us, strong under pressure, we'll make it together, our universe will change, freedom looking down a telescope, starlight never seems beautiful, well, well, waiting for us and to go escaping gravity. We'll be rising high above the rain. Sunset never gonna be the same. Thunder calling us to outer space, escaping gravity. Escaping gravity. Escaping gravity Straight to the galaxy faster than sanity left behind a land forsaken black holes and meteors Riding on shooting stars fearless like our dreams we Shoot down a satellite wings of a butterfly constellations recreating Fighting for liberty raising the energy bursting at the seams Dim looking down a telescope star like never been so beautiful Whole world waiting for us, time to go escaping gravity. We'll be rising high above the rain, sunset never gonna be the same. Thunder calling us to outer space, escaping gravity. Escaping gravity. Escaping gravity, starlight dances in the silver of the night sky. 
Way above the clouds we high, sailing high, sailing high, sailing high. Ooh, you and me, we're gonna touch the stars, find the center of the universe. No reality in front of us, escaping gravity. We'll be rising high above the rain, sunset never gonna be the same. Thunder calling us to outer space, escaping gravity. Escaping gravity. Escaping gravity. <coughs> I just might leave my mic like this. What? I wanted to ask you to this to let us. Yeah. So, first off, I give this song a like, honestly. I like that. And, as I have seen that it's free of use, so you can use it in your YouTube videos. Let's fix this first. Uh, you can use this in your YouTube videos or something for free. Let's share it. Uh, you loved it. That's good to hear. That was a good song. Not gonna lie. Not usually my type of song, but not being my type of song doesn't mean I dislike it, you know? I probably won't listen to it outside of what just happened. <laughs> but that's fair. So... Wait. The, the screen save dark thingy goes away when you just move the controller? I never realized that. Uh, yeah, of course, it's because of the gyro uh, control, but... Game has to react to that, though. So, yeah. yeah, these old GBA games have to react to that, that... From the console that did not have any kind of gyro control, but I guess... I guess the port actually just fetches all... Yeah, probably. Well, that's cool, you know. How about a cup of our homemade coffee before watching N1? What? You're not here to watch? Are you taking part? S sorry, my mistake. Yeah, now go and jump into the ocean. Take a little swim to cool off from that hard working day you had. Aromatic homemade coffee on sale for just 380 zennies. Isn't that kind of expensive? This is the parking lot for DNN TV. Cars use this road, please move along. The post of Ripita, the DNN reporter. The thrill of N1. We want you for the net battle. A poster for a new DNN program. Love and Loss. A new drama set in the cyber world. Jack in. Mondays at 9 p.m. on DNN. It says pluck on the poster. I guess they translated it differently. Plug might sound weird. Oh wait, we are jacking into everyone and everything in this game, so plug might not be as weird. Man, everyone from class 5A came out to cheer for you. Miss Marie and Mail have already taken their seats. I'm still angry that they made Mail loose, but <laughs> Yai, who never. So. Male. We never battled male. But we can summon Roll. Her net navi. Glide. Never battled. Never got a chip of his own. We have never seen him having any kind of battle capabilities. Yet he got through and male did not. That's total bullcrap. You can't just go in without permission. I am an RPG main character. Yes, I can. Excuse me? A TV station van. It collects all the latest news. It's set up to jack in. Yeah, because that's safe. Just leaving a jack-in port to your car open. You know, so everybody could mess around with something here. HP plus 100. 
Can we fit that into Me Mega Man? Can we make that not sound weird? Oof. Yeah. I think. Mm. I mean, we don't need press anymore. I guess. I don't think we can. Nope. That won't happen. Receiving data. Tomorrow's forecast. Clear skies becoming overcast later. Huh. Oh, there are battles in here. Wow. Well, Punkman will solve this. The red and blue Net Rangers, popular superheroes. Red gets to wear the cape because he's the leader. <sighs> of course. Red's net drill punch is always a big hit. Uh, it's just the same. I do not like the design all that much, though. Like, yeah, I like this kind of superhero, but like... I don't like outfits from... Super Sentai and stuff that don't have the main color as the main color on the outfit as well. This has way too much black. So instead maybe make the shoes black and the pants red. Something like that would work. But well. For my country's sake, I cannot lose. I hope Electopia can forgive me because I've got to win. It's so tense with all this rivalry. A really heavy mobile kiosk. You could break your back moving it. But why would I? All of my effort has paid off in full. I know I'll return home as champion. It's a script for episode 8 of the series Love and Loss on the net. The hero falls in love with a female friend's na- I don't want this anymore. <laughs> Why? Why couldn't it be with the female friend's sister or something? Why does it have to be the digital being? What is wrong with you? But his friend is in love with him. Yeah, and I hope his friend re will realize that. Uh, no, stay away from that. Can there be hope for either love? There is no hope in a world where this exists. Moby? Yeah. Can you see that too? That looks like a very evil evolution of a shy guy. Yeah. So it's really there. It's not that I broke my brain bone or anything. Yeah, that's too bad. That's a note down to 34. Wait, no, actually, I can do that myself today. I'll just send it to you on Discord. That's kind of the way we do it now. Don't mind me doing that real quick. Okay, can I jack into it? No. That's too bad. I'm getting nervous. Hoo-ha, hoo-ha, deep breaths. Who's the guy in the mask and cape? What is he? I like mascots. 
of <laughs> these kinds. Oh, why? Wow, the new slimmer models of Denta and Denko. Now they don't take up so much space. They do take up a lot of space. They are TVs. Yes. And they would look fine if they were like old CRT TV heads. Like this, they will take up a lot of space. For all the people who now need mental health after seeing them. And I cannot even check into them. A giant flat monitor. It feels like you're really in the studio. You wouldn't even know if that is flat. That could actually be just big on the back side. That is not what I expected this guy to look like. Aren't you a kid, school kid? Are you in a one? Well, yes. Be good and go home before you get hurt. What? Where do you get off talking like that? You're not even that much older than me. Whatever. I'm already 13 years old. Doesn't he have a beard? And they blocked off the road to the hospital, sadly. He would need that now. Why do the ends on that mascot feel like they are mirrored? They are mirrored, aren't they? Yeah. But the D isn't. Yeah. Why? Uh, little kids these days don't have any menace at all. I'm Tora from Swapopolis. Swapopolis. And I'll teach you some. In that battle with Tora? Yes. Come on then, I'll rip you to shreds. King Man. I did not expect this guy to be chess based. But okay. That was fast. Oh, we have the Super Buster still on. Uh, actually, for now we keep it off. I, I guess I'll turn it on for random battles. The boss battles can be fun still. So maybe you've got some skills after all. Still you won't stand a chance when I play for real. You were just holding back? Wow, the competition here sure is deep. If you face me later, don't expect me to show any mercy. Chess. Why was he chess based? Welcome in one contestant. Sorry to keep you waiting. Now then, proceed inside through this entrance. Everyone in the stands is waiting for your arrival. Yeehaw! This is it, Lan. Are you nervous? Not at all. I'm warmed up now. That's one more person I won't let win. This was actual story? This wasn't a... Okay. Come on, let's go. We're gonna beat them all. Right. Gotta beat them all. Netmon. Digimon! We're starting now. Please go inside. A panel used to control the doors. There is no port for jacking in. It is operated manually. I hate this as well. Because you could easily say there is a port to jack in, but it's closed off or sealed of some kind because not everything you can jack into should be available for the public to jack into, right? A program poster. They must have made a lot of them. They're everywhere. That is how marketing works. A securely locked storeroom door room. A uh, storeroom door room. Looks like this elevator goes up to the editing room. It isn't working now. This way to the studio, it says. Large stage props. Looks like they are used in the popular afternoon show. It's just called the afternoon show? Well, I guess it's like Saturday Night Live, right? Is that the name? Okay. Saturday Night Live, I think, yeah. There's something shiny between them. Oh, we got a wreck! Large stage props. Oh, wait, that's just... 
That's just the whole thing. Okay. Wow, I can hear the cheers from here. I'm getting nervous. Pulse of Ribita, a popular presenter. Her fans even take the pulses off the walls for themselves. The TV station's vending machine has special drinks. Ne Net Rangers juice! Oh, I would totally buy that. <laughs> it's just... OJ? Orange juice. Uh, why don't they just ride it out then? Because they just ate it. Um, it could also be uh, ovulate juice. They had different fruit with O in the name. I can't think of one. Oh well. But it has DNN characters printed on the can. And that's all it needs to be. Don't do anything weird. Just make it just a normal thing with the characters printed on. And people would buy that. Because they are totally dumb. Like I am. Because I would also buy that. The schedule of studio events. It's organized minute by minute. They must be busy. Oh, people at the TV station must be busy. I don't know where you get that from. The studio entrance for the audience. I don't think a studio entrance that has an on-air sign, so it also is a soundstage and everything, would have windows like this in the doors. Hey, summer boy! Okay, if anybody would say, hey, you cannot give them a racist voice or anything because I'm trying to be Jamaican sometimes, something like that. Yeah, fuck yourself. He called me Samurai Boy because I'm from Japan. The game was racist towards me first. I'm also just kidding. Like, there's no racism here. This is just all in good fun. You win in one, two. Let's get it on. I just entered the door. Yes, Moby. You're right. Ladies and... Gentlemen! IPC Inc. presents. I have no idea if people are going to hear that. The N1 Grand Prix. Yeah, yippee. Woohoo. Wait, we're actually in the tournament, right? I kind of wish this whole game would be about the tournament. Wouldn't it be kind of refreshing if you had like an RPG or something of that sort? That doesn't have like an evil world threatening thing or something, but it's just about a tournament. You might say that sounds boring because story and stuff, but if you focus it a bit less on the story itself, but more on character interactions for your team and your teammates between them, you know, and the gameplay, I think that could work well, right? Thank you all for coming to witness this historic event! I am Sunayama, the producer of this show. Allow me to welcome you in place of our sponsor, the president of IPC Inc. Our sponsor is observing the tournament from the editing room up there. I think I need to try... A how easy would it be to have, like, a voice thingy? Like, get a hall or anything? There probably is something that I could do. Yeah, I need to research that. That would be cool for stuff like this, right? I know you could get, like, a soundboard thingy, but those are expensive and, uh, yeah. The soundboard only activates the stuff. Yeah, but so there's probably an app you could download for that. I mean, not checking that out now, but that would be good. Also for robotic characters, you know. I introduce to you the D-Block Netbattlers, who cleared the prelims to vie for the crown of world's strongest battler. Oh, I, who am jacking into everything, am in D-Block. <laughs> First off, the Super Student! Nobody will get that reference. You did get that, right? Huh? The super student? What I just did? What did you do? 
Student. Super Student. I mean, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Exactly. <laughs> Nobody will get that. Should I explain? It's from a Sentai. Uh, it's from Mega Ranger. There's that one character who once grew giant size, and she was all going like Super Miku. I just used the same intonation there. I usually don't explain these things. It's more fun not explaining them, actually. Maybe we should add a clip. Go on, do it. No, I won't download clip two. Oh, that should be fine. The internet is going strong today. First off, the super stu. Wait, we have that. Who saved us all from the world three? The flawless operator of M -M 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 Mega Man. Lon. I'm having fun today. <laughs> yeah, I complained about some little things, but nothing like not like last time. Oh, that was a nightmare. The Grandmaster of Disaster. Who can read ahead 100 moves and check you in one. Tora! I do like this guy a lot. He's all doing these puns to the characters and what they are about and stuff. And that's just great. I would be the same. And then NPCs. Oh, wait. He actually announces them. He'll twist you with his bare hands. The powerhouse of D-Block. The Iron Man of Yamland, Bonzu! Hailing from South Natopia, beautiful skin, slim physique, the sexiest net battler on earth. That's arguable. Jennifer! Born in Natopia, but raised in Yamland, using techniques of multiple countries. The super intercultural battler, Johnson! Oh. <laughs> so, let's gather this. We are in D block as a guy who jacks into everything, and with us here is Johnson. They had to do this deliberately, right? This is no mere coincidence anymore, is it? Ugh. I just... Oh boy. It's not all about rare chips. Nothing is more important than your operating technique. Technical, net battler, extraordinaire. Quitsu! I think I don't have the voice I started him out with anymore. <laughs> I don't know. Something went weird. At first glance, he doesn't look like much, but he knows everything there is to know about chips. Donning his asylum outfit, the maniac net battler. Yosh! Who is this guy? Age, gender, nationality unknown. The owner of a million mysteries. Net battler Q! These are the eight who will compete in D-Block. Let's give them all a warm round of applause! Clap, 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 clap. Hey, Mr. Sunayama. In total, how many contestants are taking part in the N1 Grand Prix? There are four blocks from A to D, each with eight contestants, for a total of 32 people in all! Blocks A to C have already moved to the battle arena! The battles will be broadcast live on this giant screen! The battle arena? This isn't where we'll battle? In order to battle here, you must first battle at the arena and advance to the top four! Um, dude... It's called the Elite Four. Well then, what are you waiting for? Show us the arena. I'm just itching to bet. Please be patient. We'll take you there in a moment. <laughs> we'll be watching to see how far your fighting spirit takes you. Shut up and show us where to fight. 
There's a ferry in front of the TV station. It will take you to the battle arena. Your battle arena will be none other than Hade Hades Isle. Is it safe sending children to a place that's called that? Usually things are called that because there is something going on. Something dangerous or something. Who needs children? Now then, it's time to go to battle! Proceed to the hardest ferry! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, he's not done. <laughs> now then, everyone, enjoy the battles on this large screen monitor. I would be pissed, honestly. No, actually, I would never go to the venue in the first place because those are net battles. They can only be seen on a screen. I would rather do that at home, right? An opening ceremony full of unexpected twists. A mysterious island, foreboding, called Hardest Isle. You won't believe what awaits our heroes on the ferry. Continued in Mega Man Battle Network 3.2, which was never released. That would be such a bummer. Lan, you got mail. Especially if they released a fourth one after that. It would just be like, what? Lan, good luck today. I'll be rooting for you on TV. The item I attached will increase your memory map size. This will let you use more programs at once. That should let you customize Mega Man in new ways. Good luck. That is actually not that bad. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Uh, okay. Uh, so the weapon level we would like to have. Wait, plus one to power attacks. Oh, power attacks. Are those the charged ones? No. Huh. Wait, the speed never really... Did anything? This will give us a bug. Uh, we have this now, but I have a feeling we cannot do anything with it. Not with the programs we have. A little strange. Wait, why do we have a bug? Wait a minute, you see that, right? Mm -hmm. This is just plain ye yeah. The yellow one here. Yeah. When they are like this, you need to have them on the line. Like this, they cannot be on the line. So I moved this over, but this is like one of those with these four thingies. Mm -hmm. But why can't you see that? Huh. Not that it helps us, but... So nothing changed. Well... Wait, still a little strange? Why are we glitching? <sighs> because we have white on white. We cannot have that. Ah. Uh... Uh. I can fix this. I think.
Ja, jeg kan pikke. No wait. This is still together, that's not good. Uh, yeah, we don't really need press anyway. Weak enemies stop appearing, yeah, that's... Okay, let's run this. Okay, this worked. No, 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 not communication. Safe. Okay. Off to the... Um, let's talk to you. Oh, mail! Lan, we came to cheer for you. Good luck. How does I look kind of scary? Fight hard, Lan. I hope Lan, Dex, and Yai make it to the top four. Don't worry, nobody can beat you, Lan. Probably true. Because if they beat me, I cannot go on with the game. I hope you win, boy. I'm a big fan. Chat's really my favorite, but I'll cheer for you, too. <laughs> you ain't gonna win, but we'll do what you can. I'm looking forward to a great battle. Oh, you must be lying. Good luck. Looks like everyone else is on the boat already. Hurry along and board the ferry. Pronto. Pronto? It means to do something right away. You know, times are wasting. Oh, just hurry up and board. You know, I can't stand amateurs. Mega Man, is Pronto English? Actually, it's derived from the Spanish language. Anyway, come on. We don't want to keep them waiting. Okay. What was that? Now then, anchor some way until we reach Hardest I.O. We need you all unconscious. Good night. I wish I could get the Squid Game music up with a button. What? Something's blowing out. Oh, that sleeping gas. Hey, hey, I don't care if this is TV. It ain't kosher. Oh, yeah, explain pronto, a word that is known. Not well known, but known. But kosher is nothing you need to explain, right? It's no use. They've all been put out. Ka-ching, ka-ching, ka-ching. Who's there? What are you doing? La, la. What happened on the ferry? Are the contestants all right? The mystery of Hardest Isle will soon be revealed. This is all a script and we know about it, right? Okay, everyone. Rise and shine. We're at Hardest Isle. Uh, step to it now. Everyone off the ferry. Everyone, get off the ferry. Welcome to Hardest Isle. This is where I make my exit. Proceed to the Demon's Maw, the cave of my, uh, the cave to my right. Inside, you will find Hardest. Yes, you heard me right. Hardest itself awaits you. Many horrors lie inside. So if you want to turn back now, is the time. Yo, like who's gonna turn back now before even one battle? We're ready to go, so hurry up and bring it on. Whoa, this place is creepy. No, no, I can't wake out now. Who's the man? Me. You the man? We. <laughs> okay, that's, that's funny. Uh, Mr. Sonayama, no one's backing out, so can we go already? All right, then, my brave warriors, into the demon's den. One by one, the contestants enter the Demon's Maw. What type of inferno awaits them inside? This is totally staged like a TV show. I think that's what happens in the end. This is all just staged and we knew about this. Hope, at least. What? A grotesque statue with a demon face. Its evil grimace sets the tone for Hardest Isle. Looking closely... The eyes are lit up. Uh, yeah. 
That's not a weird thing about that thing, you know? It's an elevator door camouflage to look like a rock. That has to be the worst camouflage I have ever seen. It's like saying, this is a cucumber, put there to actually look like a dick. No, it's a cucumber, only New Gundam Gaming would fall for that. Whoa! I pressed the button too fast. Oops. This is hardest mountain. It's said that those sentenced to eternal damnation are skewered here. Now then, cross the bridge and enter the ring. From here on, my voice will be your guide. I'm DNN reporter Yasu, by the way. Please follow my instructions closely. Uh, this is probably just a set they made for the show. Come on, let's cross over. Watch your step. If you fall, you may go to the real hardest. Of course, you can always turn back and drop out. Alan, be careful. I'll be okay, trust me. Yeah, remember when we were entering that uh, space station that was about to explode? Or that place that was half into the net world and was very bad with the radiation and stuff? I have a feeling we might actually be fine here. And now we're gonna play Beyblade. I don't know why we're suddenly in ba into Beyblading, but that's what happens. Now then, it's time for round one. These are the rules. First of all, while you were asleep on the ferry, we made a couple minor adjustments to your pets. Some of you may already have noticed, but your equipped folders were changed to hardest folder. Which seems a bit unfair that because the navvies of other people don't use the chips like I do, so only I really changed. Everyone currently has the exact same folder equipped. I see. So if everyone has the same folder, this round will test our operation skills. Exactly. So, Koetsu, you're quick on the uptake. Hey, so what are the rules for round one? Everyone will jack into the port in front of you. That machine is connected to the net. When you jack in, you will enter the hardest aisle area. There are four Vict datas hidden there. The four people to find them will be able to advance to the next round. This is like the first preliminary. We've got to hurry and find one of those items. Only four people can advance. Half of us will be cut already? That's pretty severe. We have to pass this round, Mega Man. Now then, everyone. Jack in. Jack in! Mega Man, execute! Round one has begun. Only four people will remain. Who will be the ones to advance? At least we got a dungeon. You're competing in the N1, right? After you obtain the Vic data, go ahead and check out, please. When four Vic datas are claimed, the match will be over. All remaining competitors will be forced to jack out. Dr. Jackout and Mr. Hyde. <laughs> oh, there's one. I really have to use that again. Ugh. Okay. You look like that. Hmm. Honestly, we can't just remove this. Run this. And 
turn this back on. There we go. Heat shot. You know what? Heat shot. We actually... Oh wait, we cannot. Okay, let's try up here first. I have a feeling down there is correct. I was very confused right now. Uh, huh? Wait, why do I have a roll? defeat these things they're not coming out of their holes Okay, I think I found the solution, but I'm not completely sure. So charge shot shot force them out. Wait, what? Suddenly they come out. How am I supposed to get them this fast? How? Huh? Okay, but like... Oh, those are annoying! What awful enemies! Darn, somebody beat me to the state hall! And that's a virus. I'm a bit low on HP. Oh, thank you. I'm not that low on HP anymore. 
I hate how these don't give you anything. They found three of the data packages already, one left. Well, that's bad then. Ground cracking also works. Good to know. We got the hardest key. That sounds good. I think. But it was wise of me to go there first. Hi, Cannon. the water elemental one. That would have made more sense. What's up with that Navi named Q? I think I knew from the start there was a Vic data here. Yeah, and then they grabbed it, I guess? I don't see how that is weird. Hello! You're alive! That's good! How are you doing? Welcome to the stream! Uh, can I give a shout out or should I? Okay. Hope you're doing well. These damn moles. There we go. I'm a bit sick but alive. Oh, well. Being sick sucks. Well, don't. Oh god. I say as I get knocked. <laughs> I get knocked off. Yeah, this part sucks. I got this. I got this. I got this. No. Hold it. Oh, get no. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, that didn't quite work out well, did it? I came all this way, and now I need a key. Don, I'd better look somewhere else. I have the key, but I think it only opens for me. Uh, I think down here. Yes. A bulk bomb. We get so many chips, but we cannot change our chip folder. That's a little bit weird, but a oh while. Well. I guess they are for later. I definitely need to hear. So we just immediately get hit again. A double bomb. And there we have the data, the Vic data. Everyone stop, please check out. All four Vic datas have been obtained. Now for the results. The winners of round one are these contestants. Okay, maybe this isn't staged. Uh, no? They just fell to their death. Good thing they were NPCs and thus not important. Well, I thought I'd pass for sure. Oh! You've gotta be kidding. That's what happens to losers? Exactly. Losers will be... <clears throat> eliminated. Only the strong will survive. Let the weak fall to their doom. 
It serves them right for the entering and one without any skills. Winners, look over there. That is a very narrow path we have to take. To get on a not so narrow path. But... Oh boy. Cross the bridge, winners. Man, losers will be eliminated. Let's go, Mega Man. We're gonna win no matter what. Yeah. Losers are dropped mercilessly to the valley below. Those who passed the first round under incredible torturous pressure head toward a new nightmare. Little do they know the horrid turn of events that awaits them. I would say it's Mega Man. They're probably alive. They don't kill people, right? We basically have a dead child with us all the time. If you don't remember or, well, didn't know. Mega Man is actually my brother, digitized, well, the DNA of my twin brother was digitalized after his death, so, yeah. And I think there were more people who died in the first two. Didn't somebody die? I have a feeling somebody did die. Oh, okay. These doors kind of look like chips. Like, like the chips I use in battle, not potato chips. These doors lead further into the depths of Hades. Beyond each door lies an unimaginable nightmare and a winner of C block. Each of you, choose the door of your destiny. You may decide amongst yourselves who will enter which door. Of course, I can always decide for you. Okay, I'll decide first. All the doors lead to some kind of nightmare anyway, right? So I'll choose first. I'll go last. As the saying goes, good things come to those who wait. I don't know if any good things are in hardest though. Alright then, I'm going. I don't mind. By all means, be my guest. Stay tuned for the epic battle awaiting life. I am sure we know Q. Maybe it's daddy. Go on, hurry up, not afraid, are you? The horror, the horror, what lies ahead? So, I have a feeling it doesn't matter which one we take. Let's take this one. What? It's freezing. I'm gonna freeze to death. We have to battle here? Oh, we know that girl. Man, this is called the Arctic Pit. Now then, proceed, your opponent is waiting. Hey, kid, you're my opponent. Pretty intense, huh? Come on, let's have at it. Uh, yeah, if we're battling a boss, we're gonna turn this off, though. Round two is an arctic battle. Are you ready? Begin the battle on my mark. You ready, Mega Man? Roger. I'm not planning to lose, you know. And one Grand Prix, battle routine set. Execute. Okay, we have roll for starters. That's a good way to start. Why isn't the fire uh, melting the ice? Wait! Why didn't that do any damage? Ah, damn it. Oh, oh, a hole isn't too bad. As in, at least with that hole, we get rid of one ice tile. Huh. some of these things. Yeah. Just like that. Whoa, 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 whoa. This was close.
These are not good chips to have right now. Oh, that was close. That was way too close for my face. No, no. Healing? No healing. Oh, damn it. No! We lost. We got a game over? Oh. Oh, no. Okay, I did save after... Yeah. I cannot read the name of the Radical Shark! Thank you for the follow! I really appreciate that, and welcome to the stream as well. Oh, I can just hold B and it goes through it kinda quickly. How are you doing? You know what? We could just try a different one. Let's try the alright one. A jungle! Oh, wait, it's still Metal Man! Oh, but Metal Man on ice is not good. On jungle, this is much better. Man, this is called the Amazon Pit. Now then, yeah, I think this is just the same. Okay. Where did my chip go? Wait, wait, wait! I chose a chip. Where did it go? Unfortunate situation. Okay, we almost have him though. Just a bit more. Yes, we did it. We did it, Mega Man! We've got a long way to go, but at this rate, we may win. Yeah! You two can do it. After all, you beat me. And good luck in the next battle. And the victor is Lan! Ah! Tamako! Congratulations, Lan. The four people remaining from blocks A and B are waiting through that door. The four people remaining from blocks A and B. I wonder if Chort made it. There's no way he didn't make it to the top 8. Yeah, you're right. Say, the people remaining must all be really good. Let's show them what we've got. You bet. I will now explain how the next battle will... But like... There were four of us left. And then we have this battle. What if everyone won? Then you wouldn't have four winners from each block... Uh, one from each block at the end. That is weird. Maybe people lost... By choosing the wrong block. I, don't oh. know. I will now explain how the next battle will work. You will fight with new folder. Several types of folder data are hidden about Hardest Isle. Search for them and equip whichever folder you like best. Really? I wonder what kind of chips are in these new folders. Let's go find a super powerful folder. However, you have a time limit of three minutes. You must search for the hidden folders and equip one within this time. The folder you have equipped when...
Nope, it died. <laughs> when the time is up, we'll be the one you'll use in the next battle. Only three minutes? Isn't that a little short? I will guide you to the next stage three minutes from now. Now then, let us begin. Ready? Go! Wait. Wait, wait. How does this work exactly? Looking for an extra folder, are you? I have an extra folder. I'll give it to you if you want. Uh, sure. Okay, we can save at least. Let's have a look at that folder. Uh, that's a lot of bombs. Ugh. Oh no, I don't like that one. You. Yeah, sorry. I'm not gonna read these texts. It's just... We're on time. Can you stop talking? What? That is mean! I like that. A lot of bombs and hammers and... Wait. You didn't give me one? You're just wasting my time. Oh! Yeah, technically, it's my fault for not reading, but, like... You see that number up there? Cannon air... This is better. Roll and gutsman. Oof. That's strong. She just talked. What did you give me? A sword folder. We're just gonna keep that. I like that one. Though honestly, I kinda wanna see what the other folders are. Give me a minute. Best folders apparently C. Huh. Well, I don't care about that. I like this one. Just want to have a look at the the island. Uh, yeah. Uh. We weren't under that much time pressure after all, I guess. This is beeping for a whole minute now. Yeah. Great. I just realized something. My sub goal is missing. Yeah, here under the... I did remove it for the birthday stream layout, yeah. 
uh, it's not here. Oh well. Oh well. No, oh, great. Please don't work. Oh well. Two seconds. Okay, time's up. We will now lock in the folder you currently have equipped. Beep, catching. Now then, go through your door to the final stage on Hardest Isle. We call it Eternal Hardest. At last, the final battle on Hardest Isle. I'm all fired up. Well. I am trying to go sword heavy. It's a bit hard in this game, honestly, because the reach. You're missing a lot of reach with that. That's why I would never go sword only, but... You know. Now let's see. We will now hold the quarterfinals. Wait, qu so more people did win in the end. More than four. Yeah, four from the other blocks and four from UMB. Oh. Huh. The last fearsome battle determined the top eight. Oh, I'm against Dex. Okay. In Arena 1, Lan from D block versus Dex from A block. Lan, I can't believe we're paired up here. I hate to break this to you, but I'm gonna have to win. Jeez, I was cheering for me by the TV set. I'm the one who has to win. I'm going to the semi-finals. In Arena 2, Yai from B block versus Q from D block. My dynamite technique will blow you to pieces. He, 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 shrimp. <laughs> Who's a shrimp? You'd better remember this. I'm not gonna ease up when you come crying for mercy. In arena 3, Tora from D block and versus Massa from A block. Your luck just ran out being paired with me. We're talking the trash. I've been battling before you were born, and I'm not gonna lose to a baby little brat like you. In Arena 4, Chart from B Block versus Raul from C Block. Oh, that's Raul! Nothing personal, but I'm gonna to have to defeat you. I shall win this match to protect the pride of my clan. Now then, these are the rules of the quarterfinals. The quarterfinals consist of straightforward net battles. The four victors can exit through that door of glory. But it's still unfair because other people don't use folders like I do. So I have to go at them at their full strength, basically. Not lore-wise, but gameplay-wise. Now then, everyone, are you ready? Begin battling on my mark. This is it, Dex. Come get me, Lan. Here we go. And one Grand Prix quarterfinals. Battle routines set. Execute. Okay. We start with some okayish things. Oh. This thing is drawing it towards us. I should have used the sword then. Oh well. Oh now this is blowing away. Yes, actually. Uh, I shouldn't have moved to this place with the whole room down there. Eh? 
air sword? Oh, that's pushing back. Interesting. Mickey Mouse. Oh, the red one. Of course it is. Ah! I pressed too early. Oh no, he's getting the spaces back. Too bad. Take that. Boom! Hammer time. Yes! No, I lost! We're in the top four! I hate losing, but you really are good, Lon. Go get that title. Thanks. I'll be fighting for you too, Dex. <laughs> Sounds like Yai's battling. My, uh, my eyes. I can't see. What's going on? You're mine. No, Miss Yai. Kaboom. Glide is deleted. The victory goes to Net Battler Q. N no. Mega Man, did you notice anything odd about that battle? Yeah. Something's fishy about that Net Battler Q. The top four have been decided. The glorious four are these contestants. Masa? Okay. Well, we know that's Q. What is this? Uh. Twitch, I wasn't aware of this. Please don't ban me for whatever Q did just now. Uh. Let's say he did a certain kind of greeting. Like a, let's say 45 degrees greeting. Congratulations! Now then, l the locks, the locks on your extra folders will be released. Now for the semifinals. From here on, you will battle with your own folders. Equip the folder of your choice before the semifinals begin. Now climb the victory bridge and proceed outside. Board the ferry and head back to the TV station. Good luck, everyone. Oh yeah, please, please, give me my folder back. Which, actually, we might... Firebombs hits third square. That might be interesting. And definitely better la than... Uh, than the air shots. High cannon? Instead of cannon, that's a no-brainer. And that's... Kinda okay already. Oh yeah, let's save. Who knows what happens now. The elevator opens. Go up. Yes. I'll cheer for you. Oh, thanks. Whoever you are. Okay, back to the mainland. Alright, we're going back to the TV station. Sunayama isn't here. Can we just board by ourselves? He told us to get on the ferry. Okay then, let's go. Semi-finals, here we come. Alan, the ferry's leaving port. We got mail. Hello, Sunayama here. Contestants should come to the studio as soon as you get off the boat. Ciao. You did not have to send a mail for that. But okay. You must be long. A guy with a beard asked me to give this to you. Customize a... What? There's a message. If you have a mod... Uh, some... If you have a mod... Some... What? Can you make sense of this? Then press ZLZR after the arrow and enter this password. Let's see it was. Uh, uh, 
does not sound like we should do stuff like this. Okay. What the heck is happening here? So, I'm thinking this uh, mod something might be like our thing stuff. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. I know. One thing is I can actually fit it in. Run. Arrow A3. Okay. Huh? Let's have a look. L, how do you? It says error. How do I put those in? work yeah that's exactly what we're doing <sighs> press the after the error occurs, press the sel select button. Ah, select a ZL apparently. Button config. Okay. Set regular chip. Navicast computer code with a ZL. you get the mod tools install the program that you want when the error occurs press the select button to bring out the keyboard <laughs> sorry do you have the mod tools already or is it some item or whatever you still need apparently i have that okay let's remove this for now item old tool okay we don't have that if you have a mod some yeah the mod something is the mod tool ah I see that's why the guide says buy it that's the thing that guy over here sells, I guess. We can now... Yeah, those are the more tools. 
Okay. Ah, see? Now we can put it in. Uh, yeah, I know I made a screenshot, but I have it here, so... Uh, It's this one. Okay. These have numbers in them. We don't have the ability to put in numbers. I think these are just the numbers, but then I have to look it up anyway. Weird way to do that. Uh, so it was. Uh, looking like an N and the other one. Uh, these absolutely do not look like the things shown on screen before. Wait, this. I think it's this. ZXME. That worked. Good. Run complete. How do you feel, Mega Man? Great. Good job, Lon. Yes. And the thing about that is the break charge. We can probably break barriers now that enemies have. And that is like crazy good. Because those always were so annoying. And on top of that, you know who uses a shield? Protoman. Being able to break through Protoman's shield, that would be helpful. Well done! It's a pity that Dex and Yai were beaten, but you did well. Well done, Lan. Hey, Dex and Yai are on a different boat. Oh no. Strong as ever. Can't believe you actually made it. Oh, fuck yourself. Rubata, have you seen Shard? He disappeared after leaving the boat. The semi-finals will be starting soon. Lan, would you please find Shard for me? No. I guess I have to. You destroyed me just now, so you've got to be champion. How about a battle just for practice? Yes, please. You find that Metal Man has improved a bit. Metal Man, show him your power. Okay, starting with roll on the roaster, that is good. Ouch. Wait, why... why did Punkman work? situation here. Roll has one thing going on for her as well that makes her a really good Navi. 
she floats, so holds. She does need not to care about those. Have you? Who? We did it. We did it. Metal Man V2. You're really good to beat that version of Metal Man. I was sure that those customizations would do the trick. I think we're going to be great friends. Here, take this. Tamakot! And I do still have Metal Man in the folder, right? Yeah. Not the best, but... Upgraded is better. Okay, now to find Chort. Are you in there? He's not. Okay. Hmm. I'd like Chort's autograph, but I'm too shy to ask. Oh, there he is. What are you doing here, Chart? The TV crew is waiting for you. You got lost. You're disturbing my mental concentration. What? I came to get you, so you won't be late. And that's how you thank me? Fine. Miss the battle. See what I care. Hmm. Worried about your opponent before battle. How naive are you? Hey, I'm not worried about you. I'm just here because a TV person asked me to find you. Oh, there you are, Chart. Please hurry to the TV station. The semi-finals are about to begin. <clears throat> What's with you? You know I'm gonna win this thing. I'm not losing to you. Um, why do you want to win this tournament? Why? Because I entered it, that's why. With a weak reason like that, you'll never defeat me. Weak? Who's weak? So why are you fighting in this tournament? That's none of your business. What's his problem? I can't stand that guy. Yeah, still, he seems a bit different than usual. I didn't notice. You've got to return to the studio. Hurry back to, to Lan. Oh no, look at the time. Lan pronto. Pronto is Spanish. That means hurry up. All right, let's go. Off to the semifinals. Yeah, you just wait, Chart. We'll show you who's weak. Honestly? I think the reason I entered to win it is pretty solid. Why not? Just want to win. That's okay, isn't it? Welcome to the first ever N1 Grand Prix semifinals. Yeah, we're fighting short now and then Q, I would say. 32 Elite contestants battled through a series of rigorous preliminaries to the N1 Grand Prix. The best four of them now stand before you. We will now determine the first N1 champion. Yay. Yippee. Woohoo. Now, let's see a comment from each contestant. First, we hear from Lan. I made it this far, so I'm going to go for the title. Now from Tora. After taking a look at these chumps, I'm not worried. They all look like sissies to me. Chot's probably the only one who'll give me a good battle. My what confidence. Now let's hear from NetBattler Q. Excuse me, Q, please. Just a single comment. Alright then. Q seems to be a person of action, not words. We're looking forward to see you show your stuff. And finally, let's hear from Chart. I have nothing to say. I'll fight. I'll win. 
That's all. A cool yet sharply provocative statement. Now then, let's get underway with the first battle of the semi-finals. The first battle will be... Lan versus Tora! Really? Oh. What? I gotta fight this punk? I wanted to face Chart. Oh, uh, well, I'll just save that battle for the finals. I'll make short of work of this kid. What? I'll show you. Come on, Mega Man, let's mutilate this creep. Lan, don't let your emotions get the best of you. In combat, he who loses his cool loses the battle. <sighs> If you just calm down, we'll be able to win, no problem. You're right. Gotta stay calm. Gotta stay calm. <laughs> Look! The Navi's comforting him like a little baby. This battle's all mine. Oh, I'm gonna... Gotta stay calm. Gotta stay calm. Now then, Lan Tora, please proceed to the center stage. Start battling on my mark. And one Grand Prix, semi-finals. Battle routines, set. Execute! Go, Mega Man! Get him, King Man! Okay, we're starting with Punk. That's a good way to start. Also, did that just kill his statues? Ouch. <laughs> yeah, well, fuck you, Kingman. <laughs> Bye. Oh, wait, that protected him? Oh, okay. I just ate my words. Okay. Plan B. Uh Okay, this is totally not unfair. Oh shit. Uh Uh yeah, we have to do the chart stuff again, the talking. Other than that, everything is fine. Yeah. That went well, right? I'm gonna save right before the start of this again. The talking is just unavoidable. But we do now know that we cannot just fire thingy and be done. Yeah, come on. Come on. Go. Okay. Roll, that's nice. The plan B thing is harsh. You go on to the king, right, Roll? Good. Go get the Burger King. I'm not sure if the pawns will attack.
the pawns don't break the ground. Okay, the pawns do attack. Yeah, Metal Man is not doing anything useful here. Maybe it can destroy a pawn. It actually can. are just a bit problematic. I only have swords right now. I should keep in the back line here. Slow, but steady. Go punk. He's not doing his plan, whatever thing. Now he does. to avoid stuff rather. Okay, okay, we can hit him. Like that we can hit him. Whew, this one was tough. But down he goes. We did it, Mega Man. We're going to the finals. Hey, Tora, how you like me now? Tora? Man! Huh? You still want to fight? <laughs> Just kidding. You beat me fair and square. You know, I didn't even think I'd make it this far. Uh huh? You're going to accept that I beat you just like that? Well, you may have beat me today, but I'm gonna get you next time. Tora. Okay, yeah. We definitely have to battle again. Go win that title. If you do, my loss won't be so bad. Okay. Enemies on the field, friends in the real life. What? Sponsorsmanship. The winner of the first semi-finals battle is Lan. Now for battle two. Net battle Q versus Chart. Alright, please take your places on the center stage. 
Hey, Chad, you better win this, because I want to be the one to beat you. <laughs> I'm going to have your head on a platter. That's my line. Beep, 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 beep. Lan, you got mail. It's from mail. It says, Lan, can you come outside? I have to tell you something. Yai's in trouble. Meet me outside the TV station. I wonder what's happened to Yai. We have some time. Uh, sorry. We have some time before the finals. Let's find out what happened. And save. This was made so I can save, right? So, yeah, what happened to you? Where are you? What do you mean, outside, outside? Mail, Dex, what's this about Yai? You know how the losers were dropped through the floor? Yeah. Hey, you fell through the floor too. Are you alright? Actually, there were cushioned mats placed where we fell. But Yai fell right down right on her head. And that is why this is a bad idea to do without briefing and the contestants to know this. For the show's effect, that's fair, do that. But let the contestants know about it. I mean, you know how big that head of hers is. I'm not gonna argue with that. Really? Is she alright? Well, she hit it real hard and got knocked out. They took her to the hospital and are going to run some tests. That sounds serious. I hope she's going to be okay. Which hospital did they take her to? She's at the Seaside Hospital, straight up Beach Street. Come on then, let's get over to the hospital. But Lan, what about the N1 Grand Prix? Now's not the time for that. Uh, yes it is. She has other friends there and she would understand this. Lan, you've got a phone call. Hello, Lan. How are you doing? Are you winning? Yeah, are you okay? No, I'm not okay. They dropped me on my head. I'm going to sue that producer Sunayama for everything he's got. I have to give it to her this time. She is right. Yai, you're all right. What a relief. You call this all right? I have to be hospitalized for days so they can run tests. I'm so bored I ju could just scream. Let me help you out. There you go. Anyway, Lan, you just win the tournament, you hear me? Oh, I will. Wish me luck. Click. It sounds like Yai is going to be okay. What a relief. Now you can just concentrate on the tournament, Lan. Go win it for us. You can do it, Lan. We're counting on you. Thanks, guys. I won this thing without breaking a sweat. Oh! Yeah, Chod lost. 100%. The crowd's going wild. Maybe Chod's battle is over. Let's go, Lan. All right, guys, I'm off. Hooray, hooray, Lan. Hooray, hooray, Lan. Good luck. Hooray, hooray. Hooray up. The second battle of the semifinals is growing ever more intense. Neither has the advantage. This is anyone's battle. Chod's having trouble? Night Battle accused that strong? Lan, the battle's being displayed on the giant screen. You better not lose, Chod. This should have been in a real battle situation. That would be cool. Hoof, hoof, hoof. Very impressive, Mr. Official Night Battler. You're pretty strong yourself for a commercial model, Navi. Just who exactly are you? I am honored by your words of praise, but this form has its limits and isn't quite enough against you. This form... Put a man, be a lord. Yes, sir. Great desert metamorphosis! Will you turn into Procure now? Wait, it's too soon for desert metamorphosis. Five, four, three, two, one. Yeah! Grr. Grr. So. Swoza! I'm Desert Man. Zazu! Swoza! This is my true form. Desert Man! Don't delete Proto Man yet! Why? Why not kill the Navi? That wouldn't be very interesting for our viewers. The audience is always looking for an unexpected turn of e 
Is that the cowboy? Drag it out. Our ratings will drop if you delete him too early. But sometime with dramatic moves. Proto man, delete him. Yes, sir. Prepare to die. Now! Desert Mirage! Uh, what? What's this? How do you like my Mirage board? Your eyesight is in great disorder now. You can't even attack me. I'll devour you slowly. Um, uh, um. Proto Man, blind mode. Blind mode. There you are. Yeah! What? You can attack even in my desert mirage? Huh. Little tricks like that don't work on Proto Man. Chod, Proto Man. I now see why Lord Wiley is concerned about you. I believe I'll need to delete you here after all. What? Wily? Wily and Deedee. You, you just said Wily. So you're a World 3 operator. That's right. The time has finally come to reveal who I am. Cameraman? Focus on me. Who am I? You ask. Age, gender, nationality, unknown. The owner of a million mysteries. Net bet like you! However, in reality, I am I and one Grand Prix producer and World 3 operator. Sudayama! I see. You've been stringing us along all this time. Exactly. But why choose such a public stage as the N1? Usually the World 3 operates in the shadows. <laughs> I'm sorry, my little friend, but it's just the opposite. The more public the place, the better. This was a necessary step in our plan to rule the world. I see. By defeating all the famous net battlers in this event, which is being broadcast live around the world, do you aim to show the entire planet the power of the World 3? Exactly so. You catch on fast. The defeat of Ace Net Battler Chart will be displayed on TV sets around the world! Then, people will realize that if not even the legendary Chart could defeat the World 3, no one can oppose us. Huh. A feeble plan at best. What will happen if I win? After losing to an elementary school student, the World 3 will be the laughing stock of the planet. <laughs> oh! I don't believe that is likely to happen. After all, I am the producer of the N1. Are you starting to get the picture? You didn't. You won't get away with this. Chad, what are you doing? This guy's a World 3 operator. Let's get him. Back off, Lam. Leave this to me. This isn't the place for this. I've prepared a more crowd-pleasing location. Shall we go there? Lights off. Chad, come alone to the editing room. We'll continue our little confrontation there. <laughs> oh no, Shunayama vanished while the lights were out. Chad, I'm going with you. You stay here, Lan. This is between him and me. Something absolutely terrible has happened. The mystery is not that like you was not only a worth remember. But the producer of the N1 Grand Prix is Sunayama himself. Sunayama has called Chad to the editing room on the second floor. What will happen next? Lan. Right, let's follow Chad. So. Wait, no, this is not the elevator. This is the Vader of the Ever kind. A radio show is being broadcast right now. You can't just walk in. An exciting radio show is being made inside. Must be hot inside. Everyone's sweating. A control panel. You can't check in. Oh! Daddy! Uh, his daddy, not mine. Chad, the distinguished son of the president of ICP, Inc. The foremost net battler in all of Electopia. 
operator of Protoman in Navi you customize to your own specifications. Expert operator, master customizer. With you out of the way, our work will be much easier. So, it's a net battle you want. Oh, no, no, no. It is your pet that I am after. How about a trade? Your pet? For your father! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you give me your pet, and I'll let your father go. You coward. In this profession, ratings and quality footage are everything. Now then, I'll give you a moment to decide. Chart, please hand him the pet. Ah. So Chart's the heir to the IPC ink. Fortune. What am I saying? This isn't the time for that. We've got to figure out a way to help Chart's dad. If we could just distract Tsunayama for a second. Are we carrying anything that might do the trick? I have an idea. Mega Man, how about we... Dicks. I guess we've got no choice. This is an emergency. But we can't afford to miss. Trust me, bro. Blackbird! Hello and welcome. Oh, Thornic. Okay. For this scene. Uh, can you allow the... Wait, no, wait, 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 no, don't allow that. Huh? Yeah. Fuck that one. Uh, ban him. Not Blackbird! Uh, just to clarify, there is a bot in my chat right now, but the, uh, the automod caught it. <laughs> that. Fuck that one. Blackbird? We like. Hello, Blackbird. Welcome to another stream. Mm. I like my puns. Like I like my sausages. The worst ones are the best. Yikes, forever. Yes, the worst ones are good. We have that tomorrow. We have hot dogs. Mm, yummy hot dogs. With blood on them. More ketchup. We'll see. I'm not a brain in a vet machine. sure about that asking for a friend time's up have you said your goodbyes to proto man now then hand over your pet please i'm sorry proto man viewers around the world watching through the hidden cameras observe electopia's ace net battler surrender to the world three chart is now handing his pet over to now mega man attack He literally attacked with Mega Man. I did not expect that one. Blood wine and hot dogs. Yum. Not totally sure, no. Okay. I keep my eye on you. And my hammer. This one. Hammer time. Chart, quick, get your dad. Okay. Chart, take your dad to a safe place. Harry, get out of here. Sonayama, now you have to face me. Oh, so you're the one who hit me in the head with that filthy pet. I'll just cut and edit that last part. Uh, wait, this is a live broadcast. Oh, I can't edit it. <laughs> Idiot. That's why I don't live stream. Oh, shit. Uh, can you hammer a brain in a vet? I can hammer everything. It has no head. And gives no head. If it exists. And even if it does not exist. I can hammer. 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 At everything. Everything is possible. You just have to believe in the hammer. That's the thornic religion for you. Opening churches all around the world in 2026. You've ruined my entire plan. I'm going to squash you. Squash you? Squash you, he says. No, 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 no. Squash, you little 
squeebledy deebledy bubbledy bop. There is no squashing. There is only smashing. And whenever I sing, it's a smash hit. Desert Man, delete that brat. We'll see who's going to get squashed, Mega Man. Battle routine set. Execute. Yeah, we'll execute him. With a hammer on the hammer. Uh, head. No, a hammer on the hammer wouldn't make any sense. Okay. Yo, yo, see that yo, yo. What? What did you say? That spot you saw. Yes. From Twitch. From, from Twitch? I reported it. And it immediately got deleted. Immediately. You swung the hammer. I'm I like, I am proud of you. You did humanity a favor. In my favor. Is there any way to attack this thing? A huge bomb? That's not a hammer, but it hits well enough, I guess. Ouch! How dare you put sand under me? That's why does sand hurt me? This is a weird battle. It's not like... It's not difficult or anything, it's just slow. Slow like your mother on a Sunday evening. any way to hit him. Ah. Well. Let's water his hands. Three bombs like that work very well against him. If I only had a hammer. A hammer can attack like everywhere because hammers have unlimited range. Ah, if everything in the world was just a hammer, the world would be at peace. But you can't have everything, I guess. Oops. I, I will not lose, definitely. No, no, no. Cannot lose. That would be preposterous. <laughs> oh. Hmm. I need heal. Uh, can you allow that? Uh, oh, Phonics Hammer have unlimited range. Ooh. <coughs> That's what she said. <laughs> yeah, she says that a lot. Nothing can hammer the G-spot quite like it. Yeah, the G-spot is a nice place to hammer. That's for sure. So, how about that 18 plus option you have for your streams? Do I need to check that off? Oh, 
Okay. Okay. This is the energy hammer from the wolf set. Why didn't it hit? I didn't miss. Ouch. Uh, our folder seems to be empty. Um. Ah. Uh. That happens at a certain age, you know, but like. Mm -hmm. No! I did not lose. The game lost. Uh, I leave this to Reef. He's the professional. No, I am, but uh, yeah. That was a weird battle. Uh, so much text we have to jump. But I want to finish that one battle at least. Almost at the chapter's end, right? I like how he's throwing the pet itself. Attack Mega Man, but literally. This battle is like. I didn't pay enough attention there, but. At the last point, but like. Hmm. It's actually quite easy, to be honest. You just barely can hit that thing. Oh. Everything okay? No. Ah. A sudden cat appeared. That's good. Oh, they can't move right now. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, I see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That is a new move. They never have done that before. Ah, damn it. Okay, we need to set him free before we can use this. Uh, 
Ah, damn it. Missed my shot. No, I, it did go through this time. Well then, we won. Easy. First try. This isn't happening. Desert Man has been deleted. Give it up, Sunayama. You're finished. Ah! Lord Wily was quite upset with the Bubble Man incident. I can't let them catch me here. There's nowhere for you to run. Oh, Lord Wily! Wily? Lord, you idiot. Now's my chance. Or not. No, not you! Where do you think you're going? I can't believe you pulled a Bubble Man on me. We have you now. There's no escape. The building's surrounded. I hereby arrest you under the rights bestowed upon me as an official. <laughs> so this is how it ends, huh? The bad guy gets caught in the end. Say, can I ask one simple request? What is it? When the ratings come out for the Zen Wong Grand Prix, can you tell me? I don't think I can watch TV in jail. <laughs> sure. Short reporting. I've apprehended the suspect. Take him away. Lon. So the Air One Grand Prix was cancelled. If this hadn't happened, we could have faced each other in the finals. Huh. I'll settle scores with you someday. Someday. Who'd have thought the World 3 was involved with the N1 Grand Prix? I wonder what they're plotting next. I don't know, but I've got a bad feeling. I'm still worried about what that World 3 operator mentioned during that school burglary. A major catastrophe. Yeah, come on, Lan. Let's call it a day. I've got to rest my very frame. <laughs> oh, yeah. You've been battling all day long. We should also drop by the hospital and visit Yai. We should. Do that next time. Oh, wait, there is a bit more. Ah, that good for nothing, Sunayama. Bah, no matter. I already have two of the Tetra Coats. Once I get a hold of the remaining two, I'll be able to resurrect the beast. Then I'll be able to delete all traces of the Net Society. <laughs> <laughs> Laughing by yourself again? You're growing kooky, old man! Old man? You will refer to me as Lord Wily. Young ones these days have no respect. So where did you go today? I put a stop to three filthy factories polluting our air. Very good, my dear. These steady operations will help save our planet's environment. If we don't delete the net society, Mother Nature will perish. We can't let that happen! I'll do anything to protect our environment, or my name isn't Annetta. So where should I hit next? Your next target is... What? What good will hitting there do? That building holds a piece of data called a tetra code. We must acquire the tetra code to preserve nature. All you need to do is deliver it to me. So you only need me to steal it and bring it to you? No problem! You're a good girl. Just keep doing as I say. If you follow my orders, we can save this planet. Now off with you, Aneta. Go get that tetra code. Oh boy, she is being used. Due to World 3's involvement in the N1 Grand Prix, the officials cancelled the N1 finals and opened an investigation. One week has passed since the investigation began. It's been a week now and Yai still isn't back. Hey, you're right, we should go cheer up. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Now, that that's settled. What are we waiting for? Come on. She was at that hospital at right by Beach Street, right? Yeah. I think she was at the seaside hospital at the far end of Beach Street. Okay, guys, let's get going. All right, last one there's a rotten egg. Can we go then? Lon, just where do you think you're going? You're assigned to after-school cleaning duty today. Oh, man, I totally forgot. You can't remember anything, Lon. We'll just have to go after we finish cleaning. Yeah, I guess. Huh, I gotta get with it. Sorry, guys. Go ahead without me. I'll catch up with you later at the hospital. Ha! <laughs> what a loser. Hurry up and finish. Have fun cleaning. Tee Real friends would just quickly help him, you know. Don't be an asshole about it. Phew. Finished at last. Great job, Lan. Come on. Let's go visit Yai. All right. You got mail. Yeah, we check out that mail real quick. <laughs> uh. 
Ugh. Three chemical plants in Dent City were covered in vines last night, completely shutting down all functions. Still no word on how the plants could have grown so fast, but it is thought that chemical waste could be the cause. Oh no, not chemical waste. Oh, come on. Okay, but... This is when we call it a day. I did safe. And now we raid. Let's see, who is online? Who do we have here? I'd say... I'm thinking who we going to raid. Money was here er earlier, just makes sense, right? Yeah. So let's go over to him. Uh, and the raid message we will put in. Is money always... I cannot write. Funny in the rich man's world? That's the question. There we go. So, yeah. Okay. And before we go over... Links over there. Or in the description, if you're watching this on YouTube, to my Instagram, Kofi, Twitter, and other stuff. Check out the links. You will find what you find. And, way important, links to my YouTube, or Twitch, depending on where you watch this, of course, are there as well. I stream every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and I hope to see you over there as well. And until next time, have a good day. Bye-bye. And now over to the money, the maker.